Hi learners, today's topic is comprehension passage. When a comprehension passage is given, we need to read it two times or three times. They will be tick the right answer and complete the following sentences or statements. Next, the section will comprise of think and answer. Find words from the passage which mean the same or synonyms. So, let's read the passage. Bhagat Singh, the great revolutionary and martyr, was only 23 when in 1931 he was hanged in the Lahore jail for having thrown a bomb in the Legislative Assembly Hall in Delhi. On April 8, 1929, this was the culmination of a life devoted to the great task of first making India free from the British rule and then building India into a strong nation. Here, culmination means final stage. Bhagat Singh worked for a motto to free India. Bhagat Singh dreamt of an India where there would be respect for every religion and where all Indians would get the basic necessities of life. Bhagat Singh was born in 1907 in a well-to-do Sikh family of Punjab full of love for the country. As a child, his ideal was his uncle Ajit Singh who was a great freedom fighter. So, in these lines, many questions can be framed and can be asked like, who was his uncle or who was his ideal? When was he born? In which family he was born? All these questions can be framed out from this paragraph. Two incidents played a major role in shaping Bhagat Singh's life. In Jallianwala Bagh, in Amritsar, a peaceful gathering of unarmed people was subjected to indiscriminate firing at the orders of General Dyer. Bhagat Singh ran away from school to visit the site. He was greatly moved by the bullet marks in the walls of the Jallianwala Bagh. He brought back with him some blood soaked mud in a little bottle to remind him of British cruelty. The second incident was Lala Lajpat Rai's death in 1928. Lala Lajpat Rai was also Bhagat Singh's ideal. He was leading a protest march when he was beaten up with lathis and he died soon after. Bhagat Singh felt highly agitated. Agitated means restlessness and he wanted to raise a strong protest. Bhagat Singh thought of throwing a bomb in the assembly hall as a means of protest. The idea of so many Englishmen getting killed delighted his friend Chandrasekhar Azad. But Bhagat Singh said that he did not want to kill anybody. He only wanted to make the British rulers hear. Bhagat Singh and his friends did not try to run away after throwing the bomb. They were arrested and put to trial. In a statement that Bhagat Singh made during his trial, he said the bomb was necessary to awaken England from her dreams. Our sole purpose was to make the deaf hear and give a timely warning. Here, trial means legal proceeding. So, this ends up the passage. Last two paragraphs tell about how the two incidents changed Bhagat Singh's life. Now, let's see MCQs. Bhagat Singh has been referred to as a martyr because Option 1. 
he built india into a strong nation he was hang for protesting against the english he threw a bomb in the assembly hall in delhi here the right answer will be he was hanged for protesting against the english second one bhagat singh brought blood soaked mud from jallianwala bag options given are throw it into the assembly hall smear his forehead with remind him of british atrocities so here the right option will be third one as we get similar answer in the passage atrocities here means cruelty third question bhagat singh threw a bomb in the assembly hall to kill the englishman present there warn the british government get arrested so the appropriate answer is warn the british government the answers to these questions will be found in the passage only so when we read the passage two to three times we come near the answers b complete the following statements bhagat singh's life was devoted to the cause freedom of india this is the right answer bhagat singh's inspiration in childhood was his uncle ajit singh bhagat singh wanted to strongly protest against the british rule a b so first answer is to awaken the england from her dreams second to make deaf hear and give a timely warning so these two answers we get at the end of the passage last but not the least find words from the passage which mean the following coming to an end without any careful thought or planning very anxious and restless so that's all for today keep on watching stay tuned